talk about garbage, because that's another huge issue that we have in this city. Mm -hmm. How would you deal with garbage? By the way, I've already addressed it, but I'll address it again. No, no, you just mentioned waste disposal so, management, which is a big that. term. Yeah, I did you not did. say that. Oh. I said a modern integrated solid waste management system. Uh, explain to me now, what that is. No, but I'm going to just relax. I'm very relaxed. It is a modern integrated solid waste management system. It's not garbage. It's integrated, so which means you reduce, you reuse, you recycle, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. And we will have plants that will be recycling the garbage and trans, uh, transforming it into energy and other things. Before I came, I saw on your program a very innovative thing in Cameroon that uh, the former uh, footballer, world-class footballer Miller, Roger Miller is doing in Cameroon. I watched it before I came here. Roger Miller is collecting uh, plastic bag, uh, plastic uh, material, bottles and whatnot mm. in Yaounde and other cities. And he has built an industry of transforming this into building material. That's a very innovative thing. So you do that. I also, because you know me, I do my research, eh? I do my Ev research. Evidently. No, no, yes, evidently. I do my research. Mm -hmm. So I'll give you a few other examples of what even Kenyans are doing. But because we have leaders with no integrity, they can't tap into this. So I'll give you another example of what a Kenyan is doing. There is a, you, you, you could just explain there it. Is a, no, I'm going to explain it. Mm. There is a newspaper article on uh, Sunday, July 23rd of how someone called Dixon Uchien is doing something called sanivation. It's a project in Naivasha, where he's turning garbage into manure and other things mm. and into energy. Recycling. That is already happening. It's, not, it's more than recycling. Mm -hmm. So that's happening already in Naivasha. Mm -hmm. You can unveil that in Nairobi and make it bigger. Mm -hmm. Then there is another project that other innovative Kenyans have come up with. This is important. It's called Nairobi Rivers Regeneration uh, green, uh, Greening the City. This is being done by a group called the Planning House. It's an architectural group, but they do more than that. They just submitted this to me last week. Mm -hmm. And they have plans of transforming the Nairobi Rivers, not just the Nairobi River, into a very clean river that will provide water for drinking, but be beside the river will be developments, recreational facilities, outdoor events, and things like that. They have it from here to the Indian Ocean. Okay. So what I'm saying is this, that what I have is an integrated solid waste management system where you will not see solid waste. Plastic will be banned. It's already banned nationally. Mm. We need to ban it within Nairobi. Then this... When we don't have plastic, the ones we have, we will turn, like Miller is doing, into building materials because it, it's, it's already being done. So it's not a science that I'm recreating. And then we will do what Sweden and Norway is doing, turning this garbage into electricity so that people will have power. Okay. Now so, you... so, so I have a complete integrated solid waste management system. All right. You have